Hello and welcome to a new video. In this video, we will talk about the WordPress best SEO plugin that is all in one SEO. All in one SEO for WordPress is the original WordPress SEO plugin uh, started in 2007. Over 3 million smart website owners use all in one SEO pack to set up their WordPress and do their SEO. As you can see, the current version is 4.2.51, last updated four weeks ago, and the active installation in three plus million, and it is tested up with WordPress 6. So, in order to install and do the SEO of your WordPress website, you don't need to hire any SEO expert or developer. You just need to install this amazing plugin and you have to just configure a few things and you will all done with your SEO. There are basically two versions of this plugin that is you can use the free versions without buying any license but if you need any advanced functionality, advanced options, you can buy the premium versions as well. So in order to install the free versions, we will just install it and see a demo and how to use this plugin so let's start in order to install this plugin just go to plugin section click on add new and from here search for all in one SEO pack so this is the plugin all in one SEO best WordPress SEO plugin uh, original so we need to install it just click install it will take some time and it will install the free version if you want to buy the pro versions you can buy that as well okay as you can see the plugin is now installed successfully we just need to activate it so just activate this plugin okay now this plugin is activated successfully now in order to set up just go to settings and you can see dashboard uh, general setting let's see dashboard here you can see launch the setup wizard we have all these things you can import and this is the current um, status of my website let's see what is the general setting okay so in order to so general setting we have license key you are using light version so no need to enjoy great but if you want to upgrade to pro you need to buy the premium version let's see what webmaster so in this webmaster tool you can integrate google search console big master tools yandex pinterest microsoft clarity google analytics right from this dashboard in the breadcrumb section you are you can enable our dis disable breadcrumbs from here after that we have rss content you can view that as well access control who can access so this is the this is available in the pro versions okay and what happened in the search appearance so this will configure how your website will appear in google search result or any other search result let's see how we can configure this this is the current version this is uh, how it will look on the search result if we need to change in this style we can just separator or you can use this one so this is amazing you can see there are more options as well so if you need this one or if you can say this one i think this is looking fine home page this is my home page preview and this is site title and you can configure these as well right from here meta description i can say tagline okay this is fine and if you want another web page you can add that as well okay you can organize this section if you need just place your logo images from here content tab let's see what's in this section show in search result yes 
uh, so this is this is the content style in search result post title how it will look like like post title then separator if i don't need separator so these are the thing that we can configure if you don't need just click uh, select this one and click shift key backspace key it will delete it and this is meta description pages so these are other things you can explore like taxonomies image so you can even do the images as you right from here but i think this is the pro premium feature let's see how it will be implemented on post let's see it we will select a post section we will go to post let's see what's there in the post section let's i will select uh, a dummy content let's say i will edit this one and it will bring the editor tool and it will rank my content according to its algorithm so you can see it is currently 131 it is giving score out of 100 that is 31 that is pretty low i can optimize this score to 70 or 90 as well so it will give suggestion uh, your headline would be more likely to get because it is suggesting that my heading title is very short you can increase that as well and this is this 74 you can see these can these are basic seo title two error title has one error you can read the the title is too short i said that the title is too short it is also suggesting the title is too short i need to increase the length or other thing so it will help you like social you can integrate social your website like how it will look on social platform so this is pretty enough i hope you like this tutorial and thanks for watching stay tuned for my next video thanks